Hello YouTube. Today the video is on how to use the Tatler lids successfully. When I first got my Tatler lids, I tried all the tips that I found on the internet and still only had about a 60 to 75 percent success rate with my jar of sealing. The uh, Tatler lid has two pieces. It's got a plastic lid then it has a rubber seal. The rubber seal would end up sucked up inside the jar. The seal would end up on the outside of the jar or they just wouldn't seal at all. So what I did was I washed my lids well, put them on the stove in boiling water, and I sterilized the lids and the seal. Then I placed them in warm water, actually put them together. You're gonna to place the lid and the seal together, place it face down, the top down, in warm water. It being wet helps hold the seal in place while you're gonna put it on the jar. Then you're gonna use both hands, holding the lid on each side, place it on the jar, hold your finger in the center to keep it in place, and then add your ring. So you're gonna just tighten it just enough to keep it in place because we're gonna use the ball jar wrench to actually apply just enough pressure that the lid is gonna vent properly and seal. As you'll see, when you turn the ball jar wrench, it has a gauge that gauges just enough pressure that you're using to tighten the lid down. But uh, since I've started using this, I have a 100% success rate with my Tatler canning lids. This is really a pretty simple tip. I think that you'll uh, enjoy using your Tatler canning lids after this. You won't have the frustration. I was actually ready to throw mine in the garbage. But I decided that I'm going to figure this out. And, you know, I've heard some tips of, you know, tighten the lid, finger tight, and back it off a quarter of a turn. Everybody's strength is different. But this jar wrench takes all that out of the equation. It's going to use the amount of pressure each time on each jar. So after you get them all sealed, place them down in the canner. Whatever you're canning, I'm canning chicken broth today. So these pints got put in the canner for 75 minutes. As you can see, we took them out and every lid is sealed. The same four jars that went in, same four jars came out and they sealed successfully. I've done everything from dry canning potatoes to chicken um, to beans, you name it, it's worked. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments below. If you haven't joined our channel, do so. Also click on the little notifications bell so you get a notification about any new videos coming out. This is the Pressured Prepper, and I'm out.